All right, I am on a quiet mission. As you can see, my kids are all on their calls. The very last calls before Christmas break, which we're all very excited about. And I'm in here, gonna wrap up. Actually, I'm not wrapping up Christmas presents in here. But I don't want my kids knowing what I'm doing because then they'll wanna come in. If I think keep things in plain sight, they question less. So, I snuck up a bunch of boxes. Let me show you where we've hidden some of the presents so far. All right, so this is Jason's workout room and man cave. So, what we have done so far, and I can talk a little bit more freely in here because it's a soundproof room. <laughs> So last week, Jason and I went through all of the Christmas presents and they're all boxed up per kid. Like this is all Ashley, I believe. This is Jason's. And then I've got more underneath here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pick one person's presents. And then I know that I need to box things up. Like I need to box up clothing or disguise items so you can't tell what it is based on the box that it's currently in. Some things are a little bit too obvious, so that's why I brought up those little shirt boxes. So I'm gonna pick a, a name, and then I'm gonna go out and sit in my room where they can't see me and hear me, and then I'm gonna put the presents back in the boxes, and when they go to recess, which is very soon, I will be able to sneak downstairs with the, everything in boxes, and I'll be able to wrap downstairs, we probably will put blankets over the doorways into my office over the next few days as we do this so they can't see into the room, but at least items will be in boxes for the most part and then I can wrap quicker and I can watch a movie. <laughs> it gets boring being up here in my room. I was doing this the other day and it got a little boring because I didn't have something to watch except for my little phone. So that's what the plan is today. Hello. <laughs> I kind of started this rushing you right into this, but I'm kind of in a time crunch, so I gotta get going so that I can wrap while they're outside at lunch break. So, let's get going. <music> sneak peek at what someone's getting. Now I have Jason here with me. <laughs> Gets a little bit interesting now that he's yeah. here. I'm a little controlling. <laughs> I want it done nicely. Oh, I know. Is that properly folded at the top? No, it actually isn't. I would actually redo it if I was doing it. This is why sometimes we don't want our man's help, but it's a lot of work. So I we put a name on this? No, we'll put it back in her bucket. Do you remember which one is her I know, bucket? I know what bucket, I'm just like really... This yes, this is how we're doing it. I'm also trying to get rid of as much of the trash and packaging as I can before Christmas Day. So now we are going to, I have to remember who this one was for. This is part of the problem. What did I just put in here? Okay, so I, did you already put the other one in, the last one you did? Yeah. Okay. No, 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 it's fine. So the next thing we're gonna do is take these all down one person at a time and wrap one person's presents all at the same time. I think it'll just be easier that way. Then one, we won't get confused on whose is whose. And then if kids come home, like we'll stop doing Chelsea and Ashley's and we'll move on to like Kaylee and Abby's if they leave the house, which I think they're planning on going out with friends after school. So it's funny because we're watching this show uh, 
uh, what is it called again? My best friend's wedding. Because I don't want to have to like make sure I focus and know what the storyline is. I need to sh have a show that I know. But he hasn't seen it before and I forget that like chick flicks were not the thing for him to watch back in college. Probably is when this movie came out. So it's funny, he's like, wait, who is who and who? And I'm like, how do you not know this movie? Anyway, clearly a chick flick and he wasn't dating anyone at the time. I don't waste the money on that in college. <laughs> the phrase, he went behind my back, literally wrapping my present behind my back. Yes, and you got mad at me about it. Well, no, I didn't get mad at you. I wanted to know what present it was because it wasn't the shape of any boxes we had set for the person that we're wrapping for. So thank you for wrapping a present for me. Merry Christmas. <laughs> All right, while we were wrapping, you we saw this on the door. Isn't that so cute? It's a little fairy. It's the actual Seattle fairy. And it's a little Seattle chocolates package. Isn't that so cute? Got it from the presidency of our women's group at church. Plus, smart thing is, oh, it's on that side. Look at that, women owned. That's the best part. So kind of a fun gift to get. I don't even want to open it. I want to like <laughs> try and get the chocolate out and then leave the packaging. Okay, we're going to take a break. We've done one kid. Can we take all this to garbage, Chase? Yeah. Can take these boxes, boxes back out. So we're making progress. One kid down, three to go. But we're going to take a break because kids are kind of in and out of calls now. So they're coming into the room. So we're going to run some errands. I still haven't found our gingerbread houses for Jason and I. So I'm going to run to Michael's and try and find it. We have like a ton of laundry today. That's why I'm kind of pausing to do that. And then just like regular post office. I'm going to do last minute food shopping for Christmas next week. The girls and I decided for Christmas dinner, we're going to do like a Christmas Eve dinner instead of Christmas day. Cause it's always just kind of a casual day on Christmas. So Christmas Eve, we're going to do like something everyone wants. And I told them it could either, it could be, pizza it could be orange chicken from Costco it can be like panda but I want it to be like the same for everyone so I'm not making like two meals and then so we'll make it a nice meal but I don't care what the actual food is put out cute plates we'll have candles we'll have like a whole spread but it doesn't matter like that the food itself is fancy and then on Christmas Day I'm actually thinking of making a charcuterie board for myself if you guys haven't seen that video it actually went up today the day I'm filming this video I made that charcuterie board for a friend of mine for my friend exchange party that we went to last week or like the other day virtual it was not in person I kind of want one myself so I talked to my daughters yesterday and I said what do you think about like just making a big like food platter for Christmas day after we have breakfast then everyone can it'll be like fruits and veggies and crackers and cheese and salami and you know little cookies if we get some from neighbors that way everyone can kind of just nibble throughout the day and we don't have to like have a defined like sit down lunch or sit down dinner that day and they all love that idea so i think i'm gonna stop off at home depot and get another one of those circle rounds i would have gotten two the day i got the other one but they only had one so i'm gonna run in and check on that and get some handles and so maybe i'll make that today but if you haven't seen that video go check it out because it's really fun we're gonna go and get these errands started I'm, I'm mildly embarrassed to be filming the fact that we're eating mcdonald's in the car right now it's a pretty regular occurrence if i'm gonna be honest can you, like, I can't stand to, like, listen to people eat to begin with. But if I'm eating, it's somewhat, okay, oh, roll up your window. But the fries are, like, like, mega hot. Yeah, and he's trying to, like, shove four, he just did it. There's three. Shove four in his mouth. He can barely contain it. <laughs> What's wrong, dude? I'm eating them. Barely. I can hear every little thing. And then he, like... It's so hot that he spits one out onto no, my floor. I spit it out because I was laughing at you. <laughs> Ridiculous. We have a lot of errands to run. We just added two more things to our list. So we got food to sustain us because I'm starting to get a little crabby. <laughs> <laughs> Is that the understatement of the year? I don't know. I'm eating my fries. You're disgusting. Can you just put one fry in your mouth? Just one at a time. Just put one in your you mouth. Put, if you take three side by side and do bites, it's, it's the it's same disgusting. as putting, It's disgusting. It's gross. It's in. gross. Same as putting one in. No, because you shove three fries in your mouth at one time. No. I, yes. I, I slowly bite them. No, you didn't. You just did not. You just shoved the entire no. thing in. You took small bites, but you I didn't did this. chew I'll do in between. I did one so you can see how this go. <laughs> I'm not. I'm done. 
I thought we would eat slower. But you're doing four at the same time. home. I ended up having to get <laughs> not the small one I got before but the very large one. They didn't have the small one and I knew that like if I'm really going to use this board for the parties and such that I want to use it for next year I might as well just go ahead and get the big one. So I'm gonna sand that down really quick. Again if you want to see how I did this before go check out that video. I'll link it right there. Don't mind the kayak above my head. Alright, so we're trying to figure out what side to put the handles on. It would seem that he could put them on these sides because the grain goes so well, but actually these are not centered. This main grain groove through here is not centered on the board and it makes it look really ski wampus. So we're gonna put it going this way and it just we need to like just visually center it. I guess we're giving you a mini tutorial on how to do these. <laughs> Mineral oil is a food grade oil, in case you're wondering. Would you like to make your joke again? No, I'm not making About my shakuter? This is a family channel. <laughs> <laughs> it is. All right, we're all done. And I think it looks really good. I love the little knots on this side. They look really, really pretty. We actually might use it for a waffle bar on Christmas morning. Put some waffles and some whipped cream and strawberries. That might be kind of fun. All right, so we've been in here wrapping presents. I didn't film that part of it but I also dug out some of my bags that I got at the dollar store this year look how cute they are so I wanted to show you a little our little system here I didn't really go over that before so I've got our bat boxes in here we used up all the ones that were already opened and I've got gift bags and then we've got more wrapping paper at the store today we've got a little system I've got our labels uh, ribbons and tape and scissors and pen or sharpies pens don't usually work right on this kind of like material so I usually use sharpies and then ribbons and then like our extra pieces that are good for little presents I just kind of leave here and then I can just tuck it away and wrap little presents if I need to later on so here's the tree so far and it's already driving a little someone crazy and I bet it's going to drive at Kaylee crazy. It's going to drive Kaylee crazy. Yep. And then some of them are dummy presents because I like the bags. But uh, other ones have presents in them, but they're wrapped so they can't see them. I will use gift bags for presents on Christmas morning, but these guys are way too tempted. <laughs> yeah. So they're already like poking at them. Yes? You have a fun day? Yeah. You are officially on Christmas break. Does it feel good? Yeah. And you had an easy day with homework and party and pajama day, right? Yeah. We're getting all prepped for Christmas. Ashley wants to like move it to six days, but we're not done with today, girl. Yeah, but it's still <laughs> We don't, I mean, it's not done yet. Well, you have to done. actually go to bed now. That's the problem. So Ashley said something funny just now. We're kind of getting her dinner. I cut up some cheese slices, put, and I put some of them on our plate right here, but I had this piece sitting on the counter for me. And uh, <laughs> Right? Yeah. And then I, you stole it back for me, and you said what? It's on my orange. Your order? It's on no, orange. on my orange. Oh, I thought you said order. <laughs> like you're, you're ordering food like a restaurant? That's why I thought it was oh, funny. Uh, yeah, like you don't thinks... order food like this is a restaurant. But it was on your orange, yeah. yes. So you thought it was yours? Yeah. Okay, are you gonna eat dinner? Yeah. Okay. So the older girls are over hanging out with our neighbors, our new ones. The boys. The boys. Taking a liking to go and hanging out with them. And like we said, they're literally the only ones that they know here, so. The only ones the boys know. Right, so they said they don't want to come home for dinner, right Jace? They're not uh, hungry? They said they're not hungry, that they'll <laughs> come over once they start having dinner. Once the family starts having dinner, right? Yeah. Are they going to go back over? I don't know, I didn't say that. I oh. didn't tell them they could. <laughs> 
Jason's getting a little bit leery of our I girls. Met this family yet? Anyway. I know he hasn't met them. We met them many times I'm now. Not excited about girls going over to house with a bunch of boys. Well, he made a comment the other day. And he's like, dude. If I was a guy and I moved in across the street from really cute girls, I'd be like, yes, this is like the best ever. And then he was well, like, especially if they hung out with me. Yeah. And then he was like, oh crap, that's our girls. <laughs> He's like, I don't want our, anyway, they're I having trust, fun. I, I trust, trust our, our girls. girls. Yeah. I just don't like I know. The, pro the idea. The idea. I'm going to have some cheese and crackers because I'm not really like hungry, hungry. I mean, I'm hungry, but not for like a meal and I'm definitely not going to make something right now. <laughs> <laughs> Not that domestic right now. But we got a lot done, Jace. Well, we wrapped presents for three girls out of four. I wrapped two of Jason's already. And then... I wrapped one for you. You I did? I another one for you. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. yeah how... Every time you chew me out, that's when I'm actually getting you presents. Okay. <laughs> so, we did a lot. And then I made my little board. I have it kind of drying over here. <laughs> So I have a drying right here. It's kind of too big to set on my counter. So I'm just letting it kind of air dry in the warm room here. And then we'll use it next week. So, hey Ash, will you turn the fireplace on? It's a little chilly down here. So we got the board done. We wrapped presents for three of four girls. We got a lot of errands run. But tell them what we did not find. Oh, gingerbread house. Dana slacked and didn't get it done in time. <laughs> You're gonna <laughs> seriously get hurt tonight. So now all the stores are out of it. This is why I do things ahead of time. Everyone always makes fun of me because I buy like the gingerbread house in October when I see it at Costco or at Target. And everyone's like, why are you shopping so early? I can't believe it. You don't even like enjoy Thanksgiving yet. But that this is why. You get to this Christmas, a week before Christmas, and they don't have any more gingerbread houses. And now we are supposed to decorate them on Sunday. Today's Friday. Well, tell them the real story. You have the real the, story. You have them for the kids. But you don't have your Oh, special. I didn't get you. I didn't get you in the shot. Sorry. I, I thought you... you. <laughs> I... You... you. We have gingerbread for the kids. Yes, I do. But Mama wants like her own... I want my own. House. <laughs> Are you getting one for me too? Yes, that's why okay. I was looking. Okay. Last year I got a barn. And it was like the most epic thing ever. And I can't find them. And they want 50 bucks for them on Amazon. I could get it tomorrow on Amazon. Yeah, no, it's ridiculous. But I'm not You're spending over, $50 on a, for it. you know, a house I'm not actually gonna eat. So that's what, the only thing left I have to get. Everything else is bought and paid for. I will buy Christmas Day and Christmas Eve food next week so it's fresh. Kinda nice to be like prepped for Christmas ahead of time. All right, so I've had a workout, watched, um, Black Beauty. Black Beauty, the two youngest. Dana fell asleep on the couch, and our two oldest came to the door and with one of the young boys from across the street and said that they'd been invited for dinner. So, <laughs> with big, huge smiles on their face. Yeah, they had a big, cheesy grin on their face, and then I was like, to the boy, I was like, what's your name? You know? <laughs> <laughs> Trying to yell at Jim Day. I was just like, what? Anyways, they're all having fun. We've had a good night, good exercise. Now it's time for us to sit down. Mm hmm. Relax. Show. You know. Popcorn. You've already been asleep on the couch for a few minutes. There's no going to sleep now. I mean, it's been a 20 minute nap and I'm like, bing, I'm wide awake. So. Anyways, thanks for watching. Uh, the holidays are coming up. It should be fun. We've got some fun little things. Yeah. The big excitement's going to be in February when we can go on our trip. So that'll be fun. Yeah. So anyways, thanks for watching. Subscribe, hit all the like buttons and all that fun stuff. Truly, do like all the comments. I haven't been able to reply like I used to. I'll try He's to do lacking. that again. It's but okay. we really love the comments. Doesn't matter what they are, questions, whatever. Tell us what you're doing, how you're doing. We really appreciate it. For all you long timers out there, thank you. Mm -hmm. Take care, have a good evening. Okay, bye guys.